Last year at this time, many people were looking to do new things outside, like biking. That left many bike shops in the Twin Ports and around the country very busy. CBS 3's Alex Libby spoke with a store here in Duluth to learn why, a year into the pandemic, a bike shortage has become a real problem. Twin Ports Cyclery in Duluth's Lincoln Park neighborhood has been bustling with customers. Some who are having a hard time finding the right bike. The last shop I was in really didn't have anything left, so I'm working my way down the road. <laughs> Russell Alt, who used to ride three to four days a week when he was younger, is trying to get back at it, but not because of the pandemic. I've got a knee replacement and a bad knee and stuff, and my chiropractor suggested that uh, bike riding may be as beneficial or more beneficial than just walking. Bonnie Verdugo is helping her sister find a new bike. I know there's one that she liked that was sold, uh, and she, they looked online and said, you won't be able to get it, period. Like Alt, this was their second stop today, and owner of Twin Ports Cyclery, Dennis Sauve, says this is a very common sight, and he knows why. Last year, most, of, uh, most shops had complemental bikes, and the pipeline was, was at least partially full. This year, we've all run out of bikes and the pipeline's empty. With demand as high as the bike boom in the 1970s, Sove has had to get creative. Happened to have some, some uh, really nice frame sets, so we've been putting the bikes together based on those frame sets. He says mismatching frames with parts he already has, along with keeping prices within reason, has kept customers happy. There are shops that are, that are really upping their prices because they think they can. Well, that tends to come around and bite you in the butt, you know. Like his customers, Sove has had to remain patient. Normally it's 18 weeks before I'd see them. This year, we're probably looking at 30 weeks. Well, we reached out to other Northland bike shops, and they say the bike shortage is affecting them, as well as most bike shops around the country.